Hey guys, Simpy here. This is a Hasbro FX mall that I've upgraded and converted. Um, it has some light weathering throughout the hilt, uh, so I wanted it to look like how I imagined mall's hilt would look uh, after the the battle on or in the Phantom Menace. Uh, so it's got some light weathering throughout. It's detailed but mild. I guess it's um, similar to what Bader's Vault calls their their ten foot weathering. Um, so check out the pictures for some more details. I don't know how well it'll show up on, on camera. Uh, it still has its stock effects sounds. 4.8-volt uh, nickel metal hydride rechargeable pack. Um, I've added um, two LEDs to uh, illuminate these uh, once faux LED bezels. Uh, it's also got a uh, LED in the pommel there uh, to really light up that crystal nice and bright. Uh, this is no longer the switch. Uh, the switch is now here. It's one of the metal, um, metal topped ones that TCSS has now. Uh, they look quite similar to this little uh, screw greebly that was there. So I uh, just I replaced it and fit it there nice and flush, because um, it does look quite similar. And uh, it, it's a momentary switch, so it's got the uh, Pololu board in there to achieve that with the uh, FX board. Um, recharge port is right here. This is now the kill key. I made a kill key just out of the screw. Um, so, oh, a 5 watt lead engine deep red, which I was very impressed with. So there we go. You can see the two bezels um, illuminated there and then the one in the pommel as well. Uh, let's go ahead and get a blade in there. Turn the lights out. Okay. There we go. Nice and bright. I was really impressed with the deep reds. Very rich crimson color. Um, Alright, well, thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.